I just got to the cavalry trail about eight minutes ago from the Boulder Canyon Trail. This is a view looking down. It's been a steep climb up. I still have a ways to go up. Here's a view. If you could see that pool in the background, that's one of my markers when I was up on the battleship. There's the battleship. Looks kind of looks like it's kind of leaning towards the east. Now that there's some boulders at the top of that hill, so I I think I made it around the left side of those. But then that other rock I don't know. I may have had to climb climb up the left side of that. I'm not sure. You see how long that is. I know I walked down a long mesa, but it might have been over these other boulders. I'm going to sign off, huff and puff up the rest of the way here. Come along with me. I'm about half an hour into my hike of the cavalry trail this is a panoramic view i'm looking north from where i came panning around to the east south quite a few interesting rock formations There are quite a few cairns to mark the way. It's a three and a half mile trail, cavalry. It connects on the, at the bottom of the cavalry, connects with the Lost Dutchman Trail. And that's what, when I get there, that'll be the halfway point of this hike. I haven't quite been going three hours. I doubt if I'll make the end of the cavalry trail in an hour from now, but maybe. At least I'm going down. The first part of my hike was a steep climb up the hill. It took me 15 or 20 minutes just to get up that hill. So that took quite a bit of time and energy. I'll just give a view of this canyon very interesting formations nice and peacefully quiet it's been about an hour since I started hiking the cavalry trail Cavalry Trail took me due east for quite a while. Then it took me south on the inside of a large canyon. Now I seem to be going east, which is good because that's the direction of the parking lot. It's got me hiking in a dry creek bed. I need to see the crossover, but I don't see it yet. I saw those cairns. Need to look for cairns on one side or the other. I'm thinking I need to go here. 
this looks like a trail. Let's see what we shall see. I've been hiking in this valley for quite a while, which is nice less exerting hike all right sports fans now where do I go cotton picker there's a trail what do you say I stop this video and pay attention to the trail. Thank you for watching. I just came from the cavalry trail and I'm going to take the Dutchman trail east. That's the direction I'll be heading. Here's a view of the surrounding area south of this. I should hook up with the Terrapin Trail and that goes south and then, then I'll hook up with the Peralta Trail then I'll hook up with the Black Mesa Trail so I should have gone about seven miles so far no no this is the half this is the halfway point so it's not quite 11 o'clock so I made it in less than four hours so that's I'm making good time I'm glad to hear that and I don't have to knock myself out I'm gonna sit down have something to eat and take a rest thank you for watching That's probably the Peralta Trail across the valley. I'm on the Dutchman Trail. I already passed the Terrapin. So my next trailhead marker should be the Dutchman and the Peralta. So I'm going to have to wind around this mountain and down and then that Peralta trail is going to wind down and somewhere up north we're going to meet. That's uh, deep down there steep also but it's it's a nice looking valley I have to watch where I'm walking it's loose gravel and not much of a ledge it started out cloudy today and then about three hours into the hike sun came out shirt sleeve weather supposed to be in the mid 70s today I believe warming up to around 80 towards the end of the week I know you Midwesterners and Easterners don't like to hear that Well, it makes up for all that 110 degree weather that we have, right? So we deserve some nice weather once in a while. Your winter will be over in a couple months. I'm going to stop for now. Talk to you later.